Welcome to the amazing Disney animals! I am Mo and the talking giraffe! Although the okapi might look like a zebra with those stripes, it is actually related to the giraffe, they are often called the forest giraffe, the males have similar skin covered horns like the giraffe, both the male and female, have a long, prehensile, black, tongue. Prehensile means that the tongue is able to grasp, the way a monkey can use its prehensile tail, to swing between trees, the okapi tongue is so long, that they will use it to groom their eyes and ears. The okapi likes to eat fruit, tree leaves, grasses, and ferns, it has large and flexible ears and a long neck, both giraffe and the okapi include a similar walk, both have a pacing gait, stepping simultaneously with the front and the hind leg, on the same side of the body. The okapi population continues to decline, due to poaching and habitat loss, from commercial logging and mining. The okapi can be found in the dense rainforests of the Democratic Republic of the Congo, they are so shy, they are often called the ghosts of the forest, and they are rarely encountered in the wild. When you are lucky enough to see these at Disney's Animal Kingdom, they are usually alone. But if you do see two of them together it is normally a mother and her calf. As an endangered species, Disney has been trying to breed these under the guidelines of the species survival plan. They were successful when Zelda was chosen to mate with Mondazi. A new calf was born, a baby calf can stand up within 30 minutes of being born. You can find the Okapi on the Gorilla Falls Trail, on the Kilimanjaro Safari Ride, and at the Animal Kingdom Lodge. The scientific name is, Okapia Johnstoney. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe.